Hi everyone, it's Miss Becca, and I am here for the Junior Jamboree Sing Along, and today I have with me, who are you? William, and who else? Gregory. Gregory, and we are going to do the Imagine. song and the book. Imagine by John Lennon. Imagine by John Lennon, you got it Gregory. And it's about this pigeon and the friends he meets by being kind. And I have to tell you a little bit about what we're going to do after we do the story. We are going to do a scavenger hunt to music. And we are going to find four groups of friends that I already hid around the room. But you don't get to see where they are just yet. So if you want to just watch our scavenger hunt, that's fine. But if you want to play along with us, ask your grown-up if they can hide a few stuffed animals in your house while we're reading the story and singing the story. <laughs> oh, we could do it later with your stuffed friends. Yeah, we could hide Peanut later. But for our friends at home, you ask your grown-up right now to go hide some friends for you some stuffed friends so that you can play along with us when we're done the story. Did you ask? I hope so, because we're going to get started with Imagine the Storybook by John Lennon. Are you ready to be my page turner, Gregory? All right. William, would you like to sit right here? Imagine. Okay. Let me open it for you. This book's a little tricky to open and, and do compared to some of our other books. You ready, Gregory? Here we go. Imagine there's no heaven. It's easy if you try. Nothing to kill or 
is the story of Imagine and all of the birds that became our friends or this pigeon's friends through kindness and sharing. Now, William, Gregory, it's time for our, oh, hang on, it's time for our activity. So I will call you back in a minute, but go hide your eyes. Now, my friends at home, I'm going to show you where our birds from the story are hidden around the room. And then when they come back, I'll tell you how this is going to work. If your stuffed animals aren't hidden yet, make sure you've asked your grown-up to hide them. So the first one is right here, our seagulls. Shh, let's be careful, be quiet. We also have our pigeon. We have our hummingbirds. And I don't really know what to call these last ones, but we have our colorful birds. Hopefully, Gregory and William will be able to find all four that are hidden. Shall we call them back? Yeah, okay. Gregory, William. Oh, here they come. Okay, guys. Now, I showed everybody where the birds were hidden, and let's explain the rules. So, if you've ever played musical chairs, you know that you move, you walk to the beat until the music stops. You walk while the music plays and you stop and freeze when the music stops. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to do musical birds and we're going to walk around the room when the music's playing and we're going to stop and freeze and we're going to see how long it takes us to get all four birds or all of the stuffed animal friends that you've hidden at home. Are we ready? Are you ready? Because I am. Okay, guys, go start over there. Over here, William. And let's do this so there's no... Okay. You ready? Uh -huh. Okay. And when you hear the music, and you at home too, you can start walking. See if they can find them. Can I make it trickier? Who knows? Okay. I think this one's gonna be really hard. Okay, Gregory William, come on back. Okay, go to your starting spot. They're in new places. I can see they're already looking. At home, if you didn't find all your stuff, friends, you can keep looking or you can hide them again. Here we go. Hard. Yeah. I told 
you they were gonna be hard to find, but they I found them. Oh, you want to do it one yeah, more time? Should we do it one more surprise. time? Yeah. Surprise. Okay, let's yeah. see. I'll do one last time. This is gonna be our last time. If you're at home, you can hide your stuffed friends one more time. Let's see, where can I put them all? Um. We'll just put things under things a lot. Mm, how about, maybe that'll be kind of camouflage. Will that be kind of hard? Hopefully. Okay, boys, Gregory William, come on back, because we're ready, right? Okay, here's our last one. Oh, hey, Gregory. Here we go. Are you ready to put the beat in your feet and walk whenever you hear the music? Here we go. you guys but I think they're getting faster every time are you getting faster at home oh my goodness they found the That's seagulls they found the colorful birds they found the hummingbirds and they found the pigeon yeah oh my goodness well I hope you had fun with our junior jamboree sing-along today and our activity you can replay this as many times as you want and hide all sorts of things we have one request this week. Don't we, Gregory? Yeah. He doesn't even know what I'm talking about. My request for you all at home is to do one random act of kindness for somebody that you don't know or somebody that you do know. It could be for your mom or your dad or your brother to do something kind for somebody else. So that's my request and my challenge for you this week. Let's all say goodbye. Come bye. Here, Let's say bye. Bye. Should bye. we sing our goodbye song, our junior yeah. jamboree goodbye song? I want to be the Oh, that's right. Because yeah. we we didn't we normally have a song I starter. We usually have a song I starter. Me. I have to be me. Uh, excuse me. We use. I'm telling everybody something at home. We usually have a song starter for our hello song, which we forgot to do today. I wanted to start that way and I forgot. So we're going to do it with our goodbye song. We're going to sing our goodbye song like we do at Junior Jamboree class and we are going to have a song starter. I will give each one of you a chance. Gregory, would you like to do it first? Mm -hmm. Are we going to listen for your hand? Or, or watch, you'll get the next one. You'll get the last one. Are we going to listen for your hand or watch for your voice? I'll let my brother have the first one. Oh, that's a random act of kindness, Gregory. Way to go. Awesome. Okay, William. Are we going to listen for your voice or watch for your hand? Listen to my voice. Okay, when William starts singing, we'll join and we're going to sing goodbye, everybody, and we're going to get our hands. Everybody. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Goodbye, everybody. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed, my darling. Wow, William, that was enthusiastic. Gregory, you get to close us out with our last goodbye song. Are we going to listen for your voice or watch for your hand? Watch for my hand. Okay, get your hands ready. William, get your hand ready. Hello, Goodbye, everybody. everybody. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Goodbye, everybody. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed, my darling. Thank you to everybody for tuning in. I am going to have a vote up this weekend for our next story. And we will see you next Friday at 10 o'clock. So I hope you can join us. Have a wonderful week. Bye. Bye.